subscribe, hit the like button, fire it up. I'm the main host, Mondo. Let's do this. Welcome to Five Fires YouTube. Today we're going to have an adventure over here at Universal Studios Hollywood for Halloween Horror Nights. Let's fire it up. We are back at Universal Studios Hollywood for some Halloween Horror Nights. And today is October 16th. Let me tell you, it is very busy at CityWalk. It was kind of a struggle to just walk through CityWalk. So I can already tell you, it's going to be a pack meter 10 out of 10. For today, we're going to really focus on general admission, early entry. So we're going to head straight to the weekend. I think we're going to try to come up and try to do maybe La Llorona, maybe uh, Halloween. I don't know. <laughs> Depending on how crazy these crowds are, we'll see how the day plans out. But I'm excited. Another day of Halloween Horror Nights. And this year, 2022, has been incredible. Villain's been here all day. Has it been busy as a regular theme park hour? No, it just got busy right now. Like, literally, it was like calm. And I'm like, what just, calm what just I look up and I'm like, what just happened? Yeah, this happened, dude. <laughs> So I guess Sunday's the new day to come to Horror Nights. Yeah. It's the day not I, to come I, to I think it's more of a... October's running out, dog. That's yeah, what's really honestly, happening. Honestly, Horror Nights is busy every day. Yeah. But you can <laughs> tell... like We can't a, even walk right now. On a Thursday, I feel like people take their time coming to Horror Nights. It gets busy, don't get me yeah. wrong. But it just take, people take their time. And then on Saturday, Sunday, it's just like, boom. They got, they got here right, right on the weekend. Yeah, right after that. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. This might be the hardest day. Fire. Fire it up! <laughs> this might be this might be the hardest day to get through here. I'm walking like this. Yeah. I'm walking like this to get through people. Yeah, I think today even Express might be a rough day. It's 5:55, and uh, we're right here. This is where we're starting. <laughs> last time we came here, we were in there. So uh, what time was it last time? We were here like 5:30, so. If you, it was, it was like 20 minutes earlier, yeah. So early entry for us today. It's gonna be about an hour to do the weekend, but I'll take it because it'll only be seven o'clock when we start doing other stuff. But I feel like today's gonna be really bad. It's only 6:51, so we've been here about 50 minutes, and this is 120 already. And the express is crazy. Oh, yeah, we just had like three rip curves back to back. Yeah, that's express. Oh my gosh, this is express right here. Uh, it's just gonna be a crazy day. But the upper lot surprisingly still looks empty. So it's because they push everybody down here. Everybody's coming to the lower. Yeah. Killer clowns and the weekend like. It's either one or the other, and you gotta go in there quick. Yeah, yeah. we don't have no chance for Halloween today. I'll tell you that much. <laughs>
so it took about 70 minutes, but that was worth it. Do you think it was worth it? It was badass, though, right? Yeah. I got, like, extra scares today, but I don't know That delivered, yeah. for sure. All right, we came up to the upper lot. We're going to do La Llorona next. We're here with Crystal and Chris. Shout out to Crystal and Chris. So the way today's breaking down, this is La Llorona line. Is this for Terminator or what? Yeah, we're like in the backside of the mini. We're like, I don't even know. This is the longest we waited for, uh, for a freaking La Llorona. T2, right? Yeah, this is for Terminator, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Man, holy smokes. Yeah, it's just, now that it's October, it's just crazy every day. We're out here waiting for La Llorona. They said 70 minutes. We'll see how it goes. Overall, what do you guys think about Horror Nights? Now that we're, we're pretty much halfway through October. I think, okay, we're a little spoiled because, again, we have the frequent fear. Yeah. So let's just get that out of the way. Yeah. But it's been a very fun event. We have the frequent fear, so, like, we'll take a loss if we don't do three things, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Every time we come, it's, like, a lot of fun. Even if we do, like, one or two things. Because the scare zones are dope. Yeah, scare zones are fire this year. Scare zones are dope. Uh, our favorite thing is... What's been, like, the most consistent that you guys have enjoyed, like, housewives? For us, yeah. on Thursday, uh, Blumhouse was number one. There you go. And I would have never said that. <laughs> yeah, Villains, Villains. I love uh, it, Blumhouse. It just gets better and better. Yeah, more Villains more proof more that it was that. number yeah. one. <laughs> like, the first day, Blumhouse was like, kind of lower. It wasn't bad. But then it, every time we go, it just gets better. I don't know. It gets scared out of nowhere. Like, where did this go? What's like number one, two, three? Like, you don't have to say what's number one, two, three, but the top three right now. The for most you consistent has been the weekend. Yeah. Uh, Scarecrow, and then La Llorona. Okay. Most consistent. Oh, nice. I'm going to say that. That's a big. fire lineup. Yeah. And I think a lot of people agree. We, always, we live in the comment section. What are the people, <laughs> what are the people what saying? Say? Yeah. A lot of people. <laughs> yeah. Top yeah. three is probably those. Yeah. Those always hit hard. Yeah. 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 The one that we're still kind of like figuring out is uh, Killer Clowns. Yeah. So Killer Clowns, how did it go today? It was good. Yeah. It was good. It was, it was the best walkthrough we've been through. New scares, uh, more clowns. I feel us. like I've only gotten one good walk through Wait, Killer Clowns. You guys uh, uh, rope drop to the to Killer Clowns. Yeah. We've never done that. That was a good idea. Yeah, because you know what? The more the more popular ones are definitely The Weeknd, La Llorona. I'm going to say Killer Clowns and then Curious George Parking Lot Houses. Yeah. Those have a long line throughout the entire night. Every day. Even when we're not here, we're like on the app. Like, what are the wait times? I mean, yeah. Yeah. For me, I retired Horror Hotel. That one's on the retire list for uh, 2022 on me. You know what? Would you mind if it stick, stick around? If it stuck around? That's what I keep... People keep saying that. I, I would hope they could add to it more, though. If it does stay, add a little more. Yeah. But that'd be kind of cool. Something cool to do during the day. I'm kind of scared for these crowds coming for Super Nintendo World. Because it's already kind of crazy at Universal. Yeah. And then with Super Nintendo World, a whole new land, a whole new ride, new... Yeah, yeah. We always talk about that, like, once the land opens, it's going to be insane. Yeah, because all the problems Disneyland's having, they might come here, too. That's right. <laughs> Where everything's 80 minutes. Price increase, too. All yeah. that not-so-fun stuff. Yeah. Um, but again, we've been saying it for a while. It is a great time to be a Universal Studios annual pathway. Yeah, Especially we're platinum. We're, hey, we're, we're, platinum all the time. we're in the golden age right now. <laughs> hey, watch no platinum next year <laughs> or uh, no front of the line. No, oh, no. Okay, we might just say that, but we're still pretty upset about the 3 p.m. thing. Yeah. yeah. So the 3 p.m. thing, it, I kind of like accepted it, yeah. but I'm still upset. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie because like, what can we do? About yeah, Billion doesn't know any better. I don't know any better. Hey. <laughs> 3 p.m. Hey, for, for a Disney boy coming into here at 3 p.m. Oh, kind of people of the line. Yeah. Jay Lance, I'm here. Yeah, because Universal Express still works good. Yeah. Yeah. Like, there's no issues of, like, I waited one hour in Express. That was last summer's problem. Universal, get it together. Yeah. I, I'm just grateful that we have something, you know, because maybe next year we won't have nothing. You never know. You never <laughs> nah. Know. Nah, Universal. I mean, get, hey, hey Universal know. cares about us, dog. Yeah, they care about the pass Thank holders. You. Thank you for yeah. increasing the frequent fear pass. Yeah. yeah. They give us free magnets. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Oh, they're doing that right now? Oh, I didn't know that. Wow. Yeah, for me, 
uh, Platinum Pass and Frequent Fear are the best bang for your buck at any theme park. Yeah. At any theme park, dog. Yeah, hands down. Uh, we'll see how the future goes. All right, we only got 45 more minutes. <laughs> no, we're, we're moving pretty quick. We're moving pretty quick. Yeah. <laughs> was so fire. Oh wow. Hey, La Llorona is so good. Okay. Yeah, what'd you think? I love you. What'd you think of La Llorona? That was good. Yeah, that was fire. Oh, good. We got all the scares on that one. <laughs> Whoa, we got La Llorona's everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> We just got out of La Llorona, which was absolutely a fine fire. Webla the Terra is on fire with all the stairs. Overall, I think we waited about 50 minutes? Yeah, 50 minutes. 50 minutes and the weekend one hour. I have to say, that's not that bad with how bad times are right now. This is like pack meter, 10 out of 10 is broken out here. Uh, the demand for Horror Nights, I think it's another sold out night. So. If you're coming to Horror Nights any time now for the rest of October, be prepared. It is busy out here. Oh, yeah, Katie in the house. No, you're the best tour guide. Hey, Katie's hey, Katie. sighting. <laughs> Number one tour guide. Book your rip tour, your rip tour with Katie. She's amazing. <laughs> it is 8:36. Blumhouse 50. Halloween 105. Horror Hotel 75, The Weekend at 120, Scarecrow at 100. Uh, it's just broken out here. Yeah. La Llorona at 90. Terror Tram at 110. Wow. 110. Yeah, we'll be lucky to do one to... more thing out here, dog. One more thing, hopefully we can get it. Yeah. We only got time for one more thing. But thankfully, it's frequent fear, so all this is a win. In, it's we a win in back. our books. We yeah. Will be back. We'll be back for sure. It, it is getting harder and harder I, 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 to do I four things. Like October's coming in so fast that I don't want it to go away. I'm having so much fun here. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> La Llorona. Chupacabra, bro. Yeah, you saw you're scared, dude. Hey, I thought we were in the safe zone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh! 
We were getting ready to do Blum House and the lines out here. Uh, last time we kind of waited deeper in there somewhere and uh, it was only like 50 minutes. Uh, that's over an hour, dog. Yeah, that's bad. <laughs> uh, it, it has defect that way and it has defect that way. Yeah. And it, it goes all around the stadium. It's a long queue. Yeah. yeah. I think we're going to skip. <laughs> Taking the loss. Like, they don't look around. Like, I don't think you're going to do this. <laughs> <laughs> He just wants to know where the good pizza is at. <laughs> Where's the good pizza, dog? Luigi's. Luigi's. Luigi's is that way. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Step this way. The strangest sight you've ever seen. Freaks from all four corners of the globe. It's time to face your fears and come face to face with the bearded lady. The chicken geek. The fish girl and the rat girl. And let's not forget the Creepy Sisters. A gentleman. Look at them. Just staring at you, judging you. To them, you, you are all pathetic freaks for their entertainment. <laughs> well, it's time to give them a show to die. Oh! <laughs>